Hey guys, Stormy here, bringing it to you an RD comedy over matchup, which is a human, human player versus a uh, knight player right here on uh, Twisted, Meadow, Twisted, Twisted Meadows. The the green knight player is single power up here, and the uh, yellow human player down here is uh, also near. I'm uh, sorry, yes. uh, how do you pronounce it? I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong or something. Uh, let's place uh, two peasants over this Adler. He wants to get his build tune and two bells over this barracks as well. He sure wants to get his buildings up soon. This uh, uh, ancient of war is almost ready and he has just placed his Adler to build while uh, his Archmage is almost done. And his Archmage is out. The human Archmage is out here. And this is the most ideal place for creeping for humans in this map. Uh, you, you get elevated to level 2 right right as you uh, creep this place. There is a specific way to creep this. First you attack this small guy over here, then the big guy. Uh, until unless you do not do it uh, with the, that way, you, uh, you fail in the scraping. You get creep jack or something, you can say. This whip is coming here, scouting, and he knows that he is here. Now he's going to detonate himself soon, and he does detonate himself. One peasant going down, it's still alive. The troll is sincere, and the archmage is elevated to level 2 over here. The Tinker Power has taken a Oblin Tinker here. A Tinker here. He has not taken any Night of Heroes. That's the reason he got his Adler really late over here. Started attacking this uh, gob uh, this goblin laboratory creeps around this goblin laboratory uh, while uh, the human player is done with it. Uh, Sen uh, is making hope all four of us making this farm. Very fast builder here over here for a human player. Very fast, I'll have to say. Now the human player is going with a few more militias to for this creep. I think he wants to get to level 3, a little bit out to level 3 right here. A wisp is over here, I think he may be able to hear him over there. It's, uh, now this uh, thinker is at level 2 over here. The creeping is almost done. One more to go. Now, just a bit more experience for the Archmage to get, uh, get to level 3. The human player uh, Emma Sirs has a five footman here, here and is uh, not upgraded his town all yet. Very weird. <laughs> he hasn't got much lumber over here. I think because uh, he be, he's been using this for, uh, for one building. Now uh, he's making a building. He's sending. Uh, he's making all the peasants uh, make that building at once. Four to five of them like that. I think that's why he doesn't have the lumber right now. Making this arcane vault, and the, yet he is doing the same thing again. Sending three of them, making more than one worker to build a building over here. That is a very good, uh, good advantage for humans. They can build any building or very, very soon than uh, any other player. Now, Tinker Power is over. Uh, keep this gold mine and got to level three. He's making his uh, tree of life inside here. Even if the human player does come till even here, he cannot find out that he is inside over there. He's healing himself here. He has elevated himself to level 3 by creeping the spot. Now, Thinker Power is uh, seems to be going for this creep spot. This mercenary camp. He set down his pocket factory, and here goes that clockwork goblin. Now he's trying to attack. He's trying to take that, that go uh, golden over there. That, was, that will be the most wise, wisest choice. As the big ones done, the small ones can be taken out very easily. Now, the human player, I'm sorry, yes, seems to be going for a tower which over here. That he's taking uh, many peasants, many militias to his base. Seems that he wants to end the game real soon over here. Thinker has nothing at his base to defend himself. He is in a very bad, very, very bad condition over here. The human player started attacking. The Thinker is teleporting back to his base. One, uh, the tower is getting, uh, tower is getting ready over here. He has uh, three archers, two trolls, and the Thinker can use this. This pocket friendly can be used very much over here. We are going to see a lot of use of this pocket friendly throughout this game. One tower is uh, ready, and the guard, uh, is elevated. We are breeding to the guard tower. The trolls are attacking those yeah, peasants. 
or trying to uh, repair the tower, trying to build the towers. Now the footman are targeting the thinker. The thinker has down to half to eighty points, uh, killing, killing everything coming at the footman in defend uh, defend mode. The archers cannot do very much damage to them. The archers trying to destroy this uh, uh, tower. They are not able to. Uh, the peasants constantly repairing and the towers down. Towers down. The, uh, the tower rush seems to be fair for a moment, but no. Tower, south tower is being made again, once again. The tinker is at level four. He can, um, he has, I think, it pocket factory and the third upgrade, or the third ability. I don't really know, but uh, the name of it is. Uh, it's being targeted by him. He has a potion. He heals himself. These things are being made inside. He should uh, try to send him outside right now. The ancient war producing nothing. Two and of war ready inside the base and uh, I don't really know what he's going to do with them. Now uh, the home player focusing on the Moonwell. Thinker comes back inside, trying to, tries to drive those footmen here and there. The footmen trying to target him, is uh, now attacking. Uh, the footman is caught. No, he's not caught. He's out. He's attacking the towers. He seems he think he I think he's going to take the tower all alone. I know the peasants repaired just in time. Now these at answer of wars, this giant answer of wars trying to save their base. Hinker is down uh, to a hundred hit points. It can do down it it It's down It's down A panda he 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 upgraded three of it and a panda was ready over here right now. He uh, the human player is still at T one town hall making more and more present for this tower rush we have seen a similar game over here against the orc before um, the orc had one edge but it doesn't seem that the knight will be very lucky in this game one ancient of war down and the second one is almost down it will be down the panda is outside the base don't really know what he's doing there trying to heal and to stay away or heal regenerate his hit points one moon was down other being targeted more f more footmen will just coming here. He, he used this tavern, I think, is uh, using some wisp or something to revive the thinker. The thinker is going back now. We will see the combination of two tavern heroes the thinker and the panda blue master. I want tower is ready. Tower attacking this uh, at Atler tower, a pro ancient protector uh, being built behind this base. The Thinker is seems to be going to put that pocket factory somewhere near over there trying, trying to defend the base. Panda is still outside the base. He will be trying to target the footman with his uh, breath of flame, breath of fire, whatever you call it. He's, he's going to attack these peasants. Peasant with the death of flame. That will be a very smart move, but seems that the panda does not have any mana. The panda is being targeted. The panda is down to 100 point, below 100. The panda is down. Panda has been killed. Now the goblin thinker is being targeted over here. No, the uh, archmag is at level four too. As thinker, uh, even can see an uh, even battle between the heroes. But he has towers and many units built on his base. This ancient war producing nothing. See, even if he has 800 gold over here, I think it's not him. No, he does not have very much gold over here. Uh, he has an expansion. It doesn't really matter even if this base actually does get taken down. He can he can make it all over again with using his expansion. As he is a narrow player, he can build his base all over the map. Now I guess the 10 minutes are over so I think I'll see you guys in the uh, part 2.